so provocative. What is he saying? adjust my camera a little bit uh, you can't see my, my face fully and, and I know you're gonna want to see this this mug here you know so yeah probably not we've got an exciting thing so I've got we were going through um, boxes last night organizing things uh, I think I'm up to a couple thousand cars so far counted and gosh there's still at least a thousand cars I think so we'll probably be my guesstimation from the start was about 3,000 cars once I started all these seeing these roll in so I'm trying to keep track of how many cars how much money was spent in shipping and that's that's gonna be a rough estimate because not all the boxes have um, prices on them so uh, that'll be kind of a, a guesstimation on that one but I just kind of wanted you guys to see how how amazing you guys are and how much money was spent in shipping because some of these boxes are um, anywhere from you know ten dollars to to ninety dollars in shipping so uh, it's it's wild so you guys are crazy I love you so I'm gonna go over uh, David at twice diecast uh, was able to order these four a and J toys um, a and J toys sent this box to me and it's a fresh fresh case so uh, David twice diecast let me go ahead and open it he wants me to open the box because normally Dave is a guy that loves to open things, uh, as you all know. Um, he loves to open things, mostly Chinese Passats, but he also has opened a couple uh, boxes on camera, and uh, we love David. So I'm gonna open this, could be a super treasure hunt in there. He said, if it's in there, I can have it. I'll decide whether I wanna keep it or not, but this could be exciting. Also, I got another package uh, directly for me, it's hard for me to tell because I have so many boxes for the kids that I forgot that uh, liver die cast, uh, or as I call it, liver die cast, spleen die cast, or lower intestines die cast. Um, sorry. Not sorry. It's funny. That's funny right there. <laughs> so, yeah, so he sent me a custom and a couple other things in this box here. So I forgot that he. Uh, actually, I didn't know that he was sending this to me. I mean, I kind of knew. Uh, he had a video out there that said, I'm making this for somebody, and it was a Datsun, so I figured it might be for me. So, um, yeah, we'll go over that uh, as well. Um, I'll go over this one first, actually, and then we'll open this this fresh case. And I think it's a, eh, I don't even know. I think it's like an F case or something. F case, I don't know. Um, all right, so liver die cast here. Uh, got the uh, the I'm in your face. I'm in your face. So I have a lot of letters to read to you guys. Um, just from all the all the boxes that came to me, there's a lot of letters. So I will be going uh, doing another episode uh, with with me reading off all the letters, uh, just you know from you guys with the children's hospital thing. And uh, yeah, so cutoff is um, it was basically it's basically today or tomorrow. Um, if you guys want to still send something, feel free to send it, but I would say like no later than um, tomorrow. Send it tomorrow and then I'll get it sometime this week. And so I'm only, I'm giving 10 boxes to Seattle Children's and then the rest are going to, I've got about six boxes promised to food banks. Um, and then I'm probably going to do Ronald McDonald Foundation because I've uh, got a 
a customer that says they can get me in contact with someone there. So um, the cars will get to kids, trust me, uh, every single one of them. So um, any, anywho, I'm getting off track here, but it says, Dear Mark, Dots Man Diecast, I'm so happy uh, to meet you through social media and to have the opportunity to chat with you along the way. Thank you for being such a positive addition to the Diecast community slash family. I also want to send you a huge thank you for your efforts to raise cars for kids. It's a true sign of your character. Hmm. The GoPro keeps stop. It's. I think it's the voice commands that I said on it. Um, I, th I think I may have triggered it. I might have to turn those voice commands off. Um, so, anyways, uh, where was I? <laughs> it's a, it's a true sign of your character. What do you give a guy who has it all? A custom. I hope you like it. Enjoy. Sincere, sincerely, Brandon Liver Diecast. So, thanks, buddy. I appreciate you, man. You're a good dude. So, sorry about that camera thing. Man. I'm getting used to this camera. I just set up voice commands to turn it on and off, and I think uh, whatever words I said in here triggered it to to shut off the camera. So, <laughs> I might have to get rid of that function or turn that off. So, okay. So. Here we go. How many face? Or are you in my face? Is the question. That's what get written on there. So we've got uh, the 510 here. I can never get enough of these. You guys have sent me a few of them. Uh, Brandon Page, or Brian Page. Gosh, it's early. Brian Page sent me <laughs> five of them. Um, or so. Uh, so I love you, Brian. Um, then he sent me some some soap that smells really amazing. So it smells so rich and full of soap. It's kind of soapy, weighty. I would say it's on the mid weight weighty scale. Um, not super weighty, but somewhat weighty. So in, in comparison to other soaps, it's it's a little bit more weighty than other soaps. So. And uh, if you just look really closely, it's soap. Okay, so let's see. Here. Then we got the custom here. So I did watch him build this and talk about it. So it's re it's really sweet. I gotta take this out of here really quick because this thing is really cool. I've done a couple of these myself, but he definitely put his own flavor on them. Um, I love these wheels because they're they're nice little chrome mag wheels. As, as you can see, um, let me get the pointer out here. I'm sure Brandon wants me to go over it with the pointer. So we've got some mag wheels. Yeah, so this ring is really cool. He's got the detail on top of it, and he's got some detail on the bottom of it too, on the suspension components and everything. I do like these wheels because they're kind of they're kind of wide. He does have a treasure hunt and a uh, and a treasure hunt insignia on the side there. Very cool, thanks man. This will go, I'm gonna build a, I'm gonna put a display up for all the people who've given me customs. Cause recently I've got some from, I got some from the Customizer. I got some from uh, Mustang Hunter. I got some from Twice, Twice I guess. Let me go ahead and open it. Okay. And then uh, I got some here for Liver Diecast here. So thank you so much, man. I love you. Um, I appreciate the, the kind words, the letter. Um, I appreciate the signature on the back. This thing's gonna be worth a lot of money someday when you blow up on YouTube. So I uh, appreciate you, brother. So I'm gonna put these aside. Let me put this back in here. I probably will be, I might be taking this out of the card if that's okay with you, man, so that I can put it up in the display case with other cars. Um, okay, so hopefully that my video doesn't cut out again because that was super annoying. Um, like I said, it's probably the voice commands I just set up on it. So GoPro, you better learn that. You better work on your voice command thing because you can't be having saying magic words and just have it shut off. So, anywho, all right. So we are gonna open this box here that was sent to me from A and J Toys. Uh, thank you so much, guys. They sent me a, I believe they sent me a couple cases. So very generous. Um, not a lot of businesses sent me cars, so uh, I really appreciate that. So a lot of them was uh, from you guys, um, you know, us, the little people. 
you know, not that these businesses are huge or anything like that, but I really appreciate them sending these cars. So, all right, let's check it out. Like I said, as far as I know, these are all, um, these are all this uncracked case. Okay, so I believe the super would be, um, would be the, the RX3. Is, is uh, if I remember properly. So we've got um, the aisle driver, we've got the Z06 and the Kia Stinger here. Okay. All right. Then we've got the Corvette Z06 here. We've got um, retroactive and the twinning and winning cool cars. I do like that retroactive. It looks like it's going to be a good car down the track with its long wheelbase. Okay. And then we've got, um, the buns of steel, the E86 and the custom small block. We've all seen these. I do like that E86. Okay. And we got the, uh, gosh, we got the GT Hunter, Duck and Roll, and the 42, uh, the 32 Ford. We got the Duck and Roll, I think, uh, was it Ferris Fines likes that one? I think he's really into that Duck and Roll. Okay, and then we've got a C8 uh, Corvette, Transit, and the Gladiator. Right here, right here. Okay. Okay, then we've got the, uh, gosh, I don't even know if I've seen much of this one. It's got a, there's a hot tub, a uh, hot tub on wheels. We've got the, the Bel Air Gasser, and then we've got the Formula Gen 2 car here. So, showing skills are not good right there. So, reflective cars, sorry. There's a lot of light in this room. Okay, then we've got, um, Grand, couple Grand Crosses, and we've got a RX3, uh, not the Super. Okay, so, not that I can tell even if it was. <laughs> I passed one up uh, in one of my hunting videos. Um, they're kind of tough to tell. It's like, it's just the tires, the wheels are a little bit different, the paint's a tiny bit different, so, in my opinion, super obnoxious, but it's still a cool car if I was to find one. Um, so we got the duck and roll again, McLaren Speedtail, and we've got the Regine Express by Rayu. Um, designer Rayu, rest in peace. Uh, got the Bentley Continental, uh, forward, uh, forward Force, and we've got the Tankinator, which we've got a lot of Tankinators for the kids. Lots of these. These are really cool. I think the kids will really like the Tankinator. So we got that. Okay, we got another Tankinator, the uh, Jaguar F-Type, and a Velocal Racer, which kids will love um, all of these cars. There you go. You all know what the Tankinator looks like, I'm sure you've seen that one. I've made a lot of bad jokes about that one in my uh, hunting videos. Okay, we've got the Ford GT40, um, which is an awesome car, the Mark, uh, what, Mark V? Um, and then, uh, our Mark IV. Uh, then we've got the Ram 1500 Rebel, and then Form Formula Gen 2 car again. Uh, we've got the 944 Turbo, and we've got a uh, Dodge Ram, which we've got two of those here. I think the kids will really like those two. Uh, little boys like trucks. Who doesn't like trucks? America! Okay. So I'm just taking a look in here to see if there's any. I don't think we got a super in this box, but uh, you know what, who cares? It's still fun to go through these boxes and these are all for the kids, so. No worries, mates. So we've got the, uh, what is it? Erkenstein rod, Erkenstein? Erkenstein? Um, we've got a Cosmic Coupe and the Mustang GT, the, um, Formula Formula Drift one. That one's pretty cool. Uh, we've got a Forward Force, uh, a Prelude, 
Prelude, Prelude, Prequel, Lude. Uh, and then the Power Wagon. I do like the Power Wagon a lot. So the orange Power Wagon. Yep. Ooh. We've got another Formula Drift Mustang. We've got the Rigger, the Rigger motor. I think uh, Nas uses the wheels off these things. Nas, watch my videos. And then we've got the Mystery Machine, which is one of my favorite Hot Wheels. I do love the I do love myself some Mystery Machines. Okay. We got a ZR1 Corvette, the white one, um, convertible, and a '98 Prelude. And then we've got a Triumph TR6. Uh, Rapid Nismo probably likes that. He likes those British cars. Yeah, we've got a Mazda Miata. Uh, we've got the STI, which is a super cool car. I love this one. The paint on this thing is really, really nice. And then we've got a Kia Stinger again. So that's nice. All right, another Impreza. We've got a Gladiator and then the Cosmic Coupe again. Okay. Then we've got the Corvette, we've got another Mystery Machine, and we've got a little Quad Rod, which I think the kids will love that too. Okay, okay, I'm just gonna say, okay, after everything I got, okay. Okay, we got the 67 Camaro. Peter, you're doing it, Peter. Old Man Diecast would love that. We've got another Corvette, and then the Mad Props, which is the airplane, which uh, I have a lot of those for the kids. Uh, kids are gonna love airplanes. All right, we got a Bel Air, uh, the like off-road one. We've got a, a Stingray, this is a 64, so Mark, uh, 69 Stingray would really like that. Uh, I will be, I think I have one of these that I'm sending him. So I'm sending him a few cars, um, Stingrays and whatever I can find that he likes. We've got a, the, the Gasser, the, these are kind of hard to find. So for, for some people, I have, a, I have a few of them. But yeah, these are all going to the kids because I think kids will like them too because who doesn't like a passing gas joke? So, especially kids. And I'm a grown kid, so I love fart jokes. They're, they're really funny to me. Uh, we've got a Carrera. I like this. I love this uh, the green here, the recolor. And then we've got another one of those Erkenstein rods. Erkenstein, skirsh, 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 skirsh. All right, cool. We got a lot of good cars in this box for kids. Uh, we got the custom small block which is kind of like a Lego uh, type thing um, that you can actually take, looks like you can actually take these top two pieces off of the car. Uh, Velocal Racer, and then we've got the Bat Plane. Uh, so that's gonna be a big hit. Okay, and then last three cars here, we've got a 67 Camaro, a McLaren Speedtail, and then the Car de Asada, which is a sweet car too. So, awesome. All right, cool. So. Nice cars. Thank you so much, AJ Toys. Um, I'm I'm gonna go through all the letters that everyone sent me to. I don't want to I don't want to go through like every box that I got, as I explained earlier, because I don't want to leave anybody out. And as you guys know, it's it's about the kids, not about like what we're what we're giving as a person, you know, as single people or whatever. So this is just about the kids. Um, I know none of you guys are doing it for you know, self-promotion or anything like that. So I appreciate all you guys. I love you guys. You all have huge hearts, big hearts, big hearts. And uh, with this, you know, passing gas or big hearts and loud farts. So, all right. So <clears throat> I'm gonna, I'm gonna regret saying that. It's gonna be a saying now. It's gonna be all over my comments. So I'm gonna go over some cars that I found at uh, Scattered Deck Games here. These guys are a local, little local business that just started up. So they donated um, a handful of cars, uh, the Muppet cars, and then they donated six, uh, six 72 case boxes that I really needed. So that helped me out huge. Um, and um, I really appreciate that. Uh, them doing that so they're they're a new business so they're they're stocking a lot of cool uh, hot wheels so i went there a couple days ago and uh, i found i just instantly found a bunch that i wanted so and for really fair price because i got these all for a couple bucks a piece which is crazy because these a lot of these are like 2017 cars so they're definitely not charging a lot of money so we've got a, a lamborghini huracan uh, that i found there I'll try to get that in the, the light in the light right in the right light 
So I got that card. This is a uh, 2017 car. Uh, I love the livery on this car. Um, that thing's super sweet. I love Lambo. Um, I got this little cyber speeder, which looks really, um, it's really dumb to most of you guys. It's a little fantasy car. But if you look closely there, it has a twin turbo kit on the back of it that you can use on all kinds of cars if you're doing custom stuff. So um, just a, that's a heads up for you guys. I learned that from Derek, which I'm not sure if you learned that from somewhere else. Honest diecast. Um, cyber speeder. Cyber speeder. If you ever see one of these, pick it up because uh, it has a twin turbo kit on the back. You can easily cut, cut off and put on a different car. Um, the one that I've done is the RWB, the black RWB Porsche. It fits on there like pretty good once you chop some stuff off the back of it. Um, I got a couple um, uh, four, uh, 17 Ford GTs. I didn't have these, so I've got a red one and a blue one, so I did not have these cars. And I have a lot of cars, so um, that's really cool. I sn uh, snatched those up really quick. Um, these ones are free. Rapid Nismo. I know you're going to love these little guys. I love Mini Coopers. I, I plan on owning one someday, just one of the old school little ones. I don't like the new ones very much. I mean, they're all right, but... So we've got Morris Mini. Uh, these are both from 2017 as well. Uh, cards are in excellent uh, condition. So that was stoked on that. And then we found, I have a few of these already, but I couldn't pass up an NSX, um, these, the silver one, because I, I only have one of these. So it's good to have another one, because I think I took it out to modify it. So. Um, and then we've got this awesome 90, 95 Mazda RX-7 that my friend Natalie would like that because I think she's already got it. I've got her a few of those. So, and then, um, yeah, so that's it. That's all I got. So, uh, I'm going to continue to go through cars today. Um, I'm going to try to do another, another video. I forgot on what I was going to do a video on, but, oh, I'm doing a time-lapse video right now on, um, on putting all the, organizing all the cars. So. So there's that. So love you guys. I'm gonna start putting more videos out. Just try to do them when I have a few minutes at a time. Um, so I'll, I'll be tallying up all the cars, let you know how many there are, how much money was spent in shipping. And then I'm probably gonna try to do some kind of a giveaway um, for who can guess the the amount, who, get, who comes closest to guessing the amount of cars that were raised in one month. So um, I gotta figure out how to do that. So if you guys have any ideas, um, I'm gonna, because I usually use a, ra a random uh, comment picker, but for this, that's a little tricky because there's gonna be like, you know, probably a hundred different comments, and I gotta figure out who's the closest to the actual amount. So, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out, you better learn that. So, love you guys. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. I'll see if I can get this voice command to work here real quick. GoPro, stop recording. I'm in your face!